Victor. First and foremost, uh, congratulations uh, on your incredible victory. How does it feel to become, become the European Games champion? It feels great. It's a title I haven't won before. I was injured the last time. So to win it here was great. It was a really tough match. I was uh, almost uh, out and away and uh, I managed to come back and find my way back once again. It, yeah, I had to find a way to win and Christo, he played a really great match. So congrats on his, uh, on his silver medal. It could have gone both ways today, but I was uh, pretty tough in there. How do you prepare mentally for such a match? I just tried to get as fresh as possible and tried to get a better feeling than yesterday. Uh, it wasn't that pretty all the way through, but I managed to find a way to win and that's the most important thing. How, how did you manage to, to stay um, composed and get uh, through those three games uh, to, by, despite the challenges by, by Papa? I just tried to keep the shuttle on court. I tried to make it physical and I tried to uh, be tough in there and it paid out in the end. Now that you finally have this European uh, Games medal, what does it mean to you personally and professionally? Well, it means a lot, you know, it's always great to have on your uh, CV. So I'm really happy and proud about it. And uh, this gold medal is not just a win for you, it's also another medal for Denmark. So yeah, what does it mean to take home a medal with you for, for your country? It's always a privilege to represent your country and um, you know to, to win medals for Denmark is something really important to me and I'm really really happy and proud that I managed to uh, you know provide a gold medal and uh, I know for, for the whole you know Danish team it's really important. And uh, future goals and ambitions? There's the World Champs also approaching uh, on home soil? Yeah obviously I want to be in really good shape for the World Championship so that's my main goal.